I'm an executive assistant and these are my two biggest outlook tips that I use all the freaking time to make my job easier and yeah to make my job easier because we're executive assistants and our job can be kind of a shit show sometimes so I do as many things as possible to make my job easier and to be more efficient so I can get more done with less time let's go number one add a rule to your invites like I send a lot of calendar invites okay and if every single person that accepted the meeting if I was getting every single one of those my inbox would be obnoxious. So what I do is I created a rule. So anytime I receive an invite or an email that says accepted in the subject line, it automatically goes into my accepted invite folder. And that has like 3000, 3000 invites in it. Okay. Those that's 3000 invites that did not come directly to my inbox. It went straight to a folder. So I don't even have to think about it because I don't need to see that you accepted. The invite all i need to know is if you either are tentative you don't know if you're going to be there or if you're declined so those ones come right to my inbox but accepted ones cool i'm glad you can be there but you can go in another fold another thing that i always do is my executive anytime that he emails me it pops up red like it's it's red it's a little bit larger than the rest of the text that come through and it's a different font so it really sticks out and some people might not like the fact that it's red you can make it any color that you want i just wanted it to stick out so when an email comes through if it's red boom I know exactly who it's from and you can actually color code this if you're supporting multiple people you could have someone red someone orange someone blue green whatever you want so anytime you're receiving an email from them it pops up in your inbox and you know exactly who has sent it I mean yeah obviously you can just look at their name but it takes some of the guesswork away when you can see the color in your inbox and you already know exactly who it's from and yes I'm giving you a bonus one this is one I talk about a lot but it's color coding your calendar color coding your emails I say no more than five to seven colors but I can look at a calendar and know what every meeting is about because I have all of the meetings into buckets and then from there I color code them so I can look at the calendar especially if I am trying to plan a big meeting I can look at the calendar and say oh this is just a bunch of update meetings we can easily plan something over this versus having to open up every single invite and wasting a shit ton of time just to see what kind of meaning it is mm -mm. again we are trying to be efficient here the less time I have to spend on calendar management opening up invites to see what they are to see if they can be moved we're not doing that in 2024. 